I'm Emma Magnolia, and today I'm at the AVN show. I'm going to talk to all types of people, from fans to performers, and interview them and see what they have to say. Let's go. What's your name? Scarlett Scandal. How did you get in the industry? Oh, well, girl, I hit rock bottom, and I went on Craigslist for modeling gigs. I found one for six grand. The guy called me. He was like, you know, this is for porn. Hung up right away. No. Hung up? Hung up. I was like, no, I can't do this. A month went by. We were about to live out of his car. So I was like, let me take one for the team. Flew to San Diego, shot my first scene. I fell in love. Taking one for the team? $6,000. What kind of scene was this? Really amateur site called Girls Do they don't exist anymore. because I've heard about this yeah. site. It was just a regular boy girl and then a solo that I had to shoot. What kind of do you like to watch? Oh, bitch. I'm so desensitized to now. I have to watch anime. Like, yeah. It's hot. I've gotten off to Shago and Kim Possible. The tentacle. And then there's some with like girls with huge. And I always have fantasies. And then I'll start dreaming of me getting by these girls with the huge. It's great. It's it's amazing. What's your name? Chris Kendall. Do you have any embarrassing stories? It's not embarrassing. It's about her. She's gonna hate me for that. Please tell it, I please. Love, I love dirty in my mouth, like drinking, and, and I'm like, you got a in my mouth. And she's like, no, babe, I can't do this. And so I'm like, I love this shit. You gotta do it. And she and she can do it for now. So I'm waiting for the day when she's gonna do it. You think she will? At some point, I think she will. She's very comfortable. It's small thing with herself. That's love. That's oh, love. Okay. Fuck yeah. She was being so horny last night. Do you want to see the video of me eating your friend's? Yes. Look, 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 look. It's me under the table. Under the table. Is this real? Yeah. Look. look, 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 look. Don't this is the best them. thing I've ever seen in my life. Yeah, that true. is the most amazing thing I have ever seen in my life. She's I next. wish you guys could see that. I'm yeah, so happy. Next. That's so your happy. damn right I'm next. Or what's your ideal size? You know what? It depends on how horny I am. If I'm really horny, I could take a big one. I agree. If I'm extremely horny, I could do That's a big it. But if I'm regular horny, I'm like, you need to tone it down. Yeah. You need to tone yeah. it down right now, sir. Boyfriend. What's your body count? Oh. You're slutty. And I like it. No, actually, no. Before was three. Really? But now I don't know. Can you give me a rough estimate? I want to say maybe like 20. So equal opportunity body count. 20, your t full body count is 25? I think 25, 30. Oh my gosh. Yeah. That's so much lower than I expected. Really? Yeah, because you're horny as fuck. Dude, I am horny as fuck. Okay, what's your name? Alex Jones. Loveless. Can you tell me an embarrassing story? Oh no. I feel like you have a lot of them. Because <laughs> you've got, just because you have like the sheer amount of that you have, there's got to be some embarrassment thrown in there. I did a scene with a girl one time who had like cheese and milk we were like did you really have cheese and milk and, you know it's okay so we start going and I'm her and then uh, <laughs> I pop out and I feel like a squirt on me and I was like oh she squirted I want to see and I look and she sh all over me <laughs> the director's like like next position and I'm like do you not see the sh all over me can you tell us your name? My username or my real name? My name's Adrian. Why did you come here? Uh, cause it's AVN, you know, I wanted to meet you, obviously. A couple of my friends I haven't seen in three years since the last time. I'm TDM, known as like the porn connoisseur, or because I know a lot of the performers here. Sophie D, there's Emma Magnolia, yo, there's Kazumi. Sex work is real work, go out and support it. Tip your cam girls, go to strip clubs, tip your dancers, yeah. decriminalize it, you know, because yes. it's a real job. And uh, to quote this from Janice Griffith, if sex work isn't a real job, why do they have to pay taxes? Tax, that's true. Uh, I'm Leo Weiss. Amazing, what's your name? Uh, Bella Blue. Bella, can you tell us an embarrassing Story. One time, I was embarrassed. The guy handled it really well. It was my birthday, this guy and I just met, and I was like really excited to have f right? We go to two, have f puts it in, and pulls out, and he goes, did you forget you did like a monostat or something? I don't know what the f was inside of me. He like unlocked a chamber of, you know, normal discharge that we have. The discharge okay. chamber. Yes, and I was like, oh my God, I'm so sorry. I like literally had a meltdown. This fool's like, Used to that shit. He's okay, next question. What's your body count? I have it in my phone. You have it in your phone? You So you make but you keep the list? Yeah, I have some, but I have two lists. One list of like people I like normal people, whether they're or not. Like not It's an off camera list, yes. Okay. And then I have my camera list. Which one's phone. longer? Well, right. Um, <laughs> personal one, probably. I've had some time having What's your name? Roxy Center. What are you doing here? I'm trying to find somebody to. 
What's your body count? 157. You have an exact. I have a review. Sometimes I go back if I if like they did better than the time after that. I'm like, all right, correction. Da 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 da. They get a revision. Who's somebody that has a really good review that I would know? You and Zumi. I have a good review. She's gonna read my sex review. Yeah, Where you at? Where you at? Look, I got Sydney. Holy water. Sydney got a 10 out of 10. Well, yeah, she got a 10 out of 10. She deserves it. Emma. Fat ass. Ugh. She got a fat ass and she screwed it in my face. 16 out of 10. <laughs> hey, what's your name? Savannah Bloom. Do you, what do you like better? Or small I like them different for different reasons. Like I like small for anal, big for oral. Big for oral? I feel like I struggle with that. Really? Yeah, if I, if I can't get it all the way into my mouth, I'm like, I'm gonna myself. That is true, but I feel like when it looks really big in my mouth, I like get off to that. Just visual? Yeah, and like, yeah. oh my god, it looks so big in like my mouth, yes. What kind of do you watch? Uh, I really like like male ASMR it's really weird. Wait, will you explain what that's like? It's like men off and they're just like talking to you like oh yeah baby like do you, like it's really cheesy it's like a male J.O.I. yeah yeah exactly yeah this is fascinating to me first of all what's your name uh, my name is the wizard of bod the wizard of bodacious tell me how you got into the industry and what you do oh my god i'm the publisher and editor of bodacious magazine we've been doing a bodacious magazine for the past 15 years we feature plus size women in a way that you've never seen before this is the creme de la creme high quality pages 2023 bodacious calendar have a beautiful luxurious woman for you month after month after a month, continuously. How'd you start doing this? About 16 years ago, I was dating a plus size woman and we went to a public function and she felt a little bit uncomfortable because some people were laughing. Just to show you that men do love and appreciate large women, I'll create a magazine for you. That's really sweet. I went to a nightclub and there were two girls who wanted to take me home for a threesome. Were they both thick girls? Actually, they were, but one was a plus size and one was a super size. For some reason, I didn't have a car that night to drive anywhere with anybody. So needless to say, I missed my first threesome in my life because I didn't have a car. You fucked up. I know, I really did. Leo, what's your body count? I stopped counting after 100 and that was before I got in no, no, That was before you got in no, Were you just getting laid like crazy? No, I was just man whoring it up. Like as a normal person does when you're like single in your late 20s. I hook up with this one girl and like we're in the middle of having sex. Like this was before I got into but I was like telling her I was planning to get into it. So she's like, oh, I'm gonna have sex with this star guy right so she comes over we're hooking up and we're having and she's just like you know slap me spin on me this and this i'm like okay if you ask for it so i spin on her i slap her and so forth we finish having and it's like i'm like did you have fun she's like i didn't really like being slapped and spit on <laughs> but she asked for it exactly so i'm like not my fault i didn't suggest that like she learned something about herself I'm Koi Grin, and I'm a VTuber and a LootTuber. It's kind of like camming, but I'm the anime girl. Everything I do, my model does. It's like tie camming. Yes. That's so cool. What's your body count? Seven. That's a good number. I have a love and machine. Really nervous. It was like my first time using the machine on stream. Elbow had hit the machine button, and it turned it on full speed. I screamed so loud. But then I like immediately got into it. What's your name? My name is Amari Ann. Amari, what do you do? I suck and lick. What's your body count? <laughs> this year? Yes. Yeah, yeah. and and oh my god, stop. It's like January 4th. <laughs> <laughs> but overall, I don't even know. I couldn't count. Do I have to count? Can you like give us over, ballpark? Over over 300 at least. Like a minimum. One time this guy like I slept with him or whatever. I guess he was just like so amazed by like my I guess. And he ended up buying me a chastity belt. Basically, like, this is too f***ing good. Like, you need to lock this shit up. So now I have a chastity belt in my closet for no reason. I'm not going to use it. Is there anything that you could do that would compel you to put it on? I can go without people, but, like, not touching myself. Like, it's not happening. No. <laughs> Okay, so what's your name? My name is Lydia Black. I'm a BDSM and star, and I've been in the industry for like five or six years. What's your body count? Oh, over like 300, 400, probably. I do a lot of because that's all I can tell you. What kind of do you like to watch? I like to watch to be honest. Like, I don't like to watch real people anymore. I gotta do something a little more weird. Is there anything that you haven't done that you want to try? You seem like you've done a lot of extreme stuff. I haven't done what they call like a public scene where you 
in front of like a lot of people like publicly. So I want to do a public disgrace scene. I was at a BDSM club and I got tied up. People ate a bunch of sushi off of me while I was dangling in the air. That was very fun. Once again, I'm Emma Magnolia. I hope you enjoyed my interviews. If you want me to drop another one, put a, put a comment below and I might just do it. <laughs> Bye! <laughs>